Hey guys, hello and welcome to episode 38 of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy, where we continue to conquer my, unfortunately, my least favorite galaxy in the game. This galaxy sucks. That's the only way to put it. And we're in deep dark again. Ah, uh, sigh. Deep dark galaxy mission one again would be the underground ghost ship, which we're going back to, to get our hidden star. And I'm skipping this intro important and I'm tired of dealing with this galaxy and I've already only, I've only done two stars here and already completely tired of this galaxy. What the hell's up with that? That ain't good, is it? Not even a little bit. Oh, I didn't mean to get that rainbow star. Now I have to kill all of you again. Take my anger out on these guys. Die, die, die. I should definitely get a I should definitely be getting a one-up for that. What is this? Mario Mario Galaxy 2, that'd be a one-up. This is boring. This galaxy sucks. No one likes to be dark. And my batteries are dying. This hidden star is actually relatively challenging to find. Not challenging to accomplish at all. It's really easy to accomplish, actually. But it is so hard to find. If you don't know where you're going, you can spend hours just searching and searching and not finding and not finding. A pretty painful experience, I have to say. The first time I played through this game, it took me forever. You can kind of see, oh, I just hit the mine, so I lost. Oh well, who cares? And as you can see, the ship I blew up. And it takes you to the secret planet here, where you can that boo. Oh look, a power star inside that boo. What, what creative way. How am I ever going to get killed? I'm going to break this glass. And lure him into water. Yep, it really is that easy, folks. And there it is, power star number three, which is actually our hidden star of the deep dark galaxy, which means we are halfway done with this hell hole. in a box. Hidden star done. <clears throat> yes, save my game. And here we are. We are heading right on back to the deep dark galaxy, unfortunately, where we are going to take on star number two. Star number two, which is known as Bubble Blaster. <clears throat> and it involves Flood. Those of you who play Super Mario Sunshine, you know what I'm talking about. There's Flood, right there. Flood. Oh, look, this mole bubble shooting piece of crap. He thinks I'm actually going to take the time to fight him. Because he's guarding the kid. You know what? Yes. I don't care about you. I'm leaving. Have fun terrorizing this beach. It's not my beach. Okay, screw you, crab. You're dying now. Thank you for being obnoxious. You now gave me a reason. Stupid crap. Yeah, I don't care what he's doing. Yeah, no one really cares what he's doing because we don't need him. See? That's way easier than whatever method I would have to resort to by killing him. Plus, killing him is a waste of time. There we go. See if we can avoid speedrun tactics. Yeah, I don't care enough to actually get that coin. Is there a coin right here I can get? 
Bubble blast off to this next planet where we get the better, decent music. Better than that stupid cave music, which I really dislike. Yeah, I'm just gonna complain a lot about it. Okay, screw you, cheap cheap. I don't care enough to kill you. I'm really not that good. And Flood is alive! Grab these coins because I need health. Here we go, fly. And we can get to ground pound all three tennis balls at the same time. Okay. Oh, the last two at the same time successfully. And there it is, power star, power star. And it's a coin star. Where's my change? Dollar bills. Whatever. Same difference. You know what I mean. Screw all of you. Ah. Ah. Oh. Yeah. And we'll save the game, of course. And let's move right on to the third star and final normal star that's not a comet of the deep dark galaxy! Wahoo! Deep dark galaxy star number three is called Guppy in the underground lake. What? Guppy's back? Ah, Guppy. What a wimp. He's a wimp anyway. No one cares. He's easy to beat. He's just gonna fly away anyway once I swim through his stupid ranks. You know, this galaxy isn't very deep, or dark for that matter. It's pretty bright here for a deep dark galaxy. It seems more like a tropical vacation than a deep dark galaxy. And of course, it involves us swimming all the way down here to vanish, banish Guppy from our terrible from his terrible, torturous deeds in the underground. There he is, stupid Guppy, causing trouble again. You think he'd learn, just like Bowser. Bowser doesn't learn either. So, it's a Mario enemy, they don't learn. They just do what they want. And fail as well. Yeah, and not just want to, I'm going to. Oh, swim through all eight rings. This is such a difficult challenge. I mean, it was so difficult the first time. Guppy's got to realize that, you know, these challenges are just kind of doing coming up to way too easy. I mean, really. If it was so, if it was easy the last time, we'll make it, we'll make it difficult this time. I mean, come on, this is even a shorter area. I don't even have to swim all the way around the galaxy. Brake lights. Gotta love the brake lights. And there's an eel back here, don't die. There it is, success, even though I almost failed. There. But it's okay, we only have one ring left, and we're gonna succeed. Oh no, I might have failed. And success with almost no time left. That would have been a pathetic fail after I made fun of how easy this mission was. But you know, it would have been, but it wasn't. There it is! Power Star is gotten! you believe it? We only have one more pointless, annoying star to get in our stupid deep dark galaxy, and then we can finally put it to rest. And go on to more enjoyable galaxies. But, it's an actually challenging Daredevil comic we gotta do right now. Well, it was challenging the first couple times I did this. Do you notice the mission? Yes, it's a Daredevil comic. 
I didn't get hit once anyway. But, you know, it's always harder on the Daredevil run for some reason to not get hit. And I don't know why. It just is. It's weird like that. It's one of those things. It can't be explained. It's just, you know, weird. I mean, it hasn't even been proven that we exist yet. You know that? What if we don't even exist? I don't know. Someone can answer that question. I don't have an answer. What if we don't even exist? I don't know. We should get Mr. Petrus to answer that question. He's a, he's a brilliant physics teacher. And no, there was no, no sarcasm. Not one degree of sarcasm in my voice. So no pictures. First, we don't succeed. Die, die again. Die, Camilla. Camilla, Camilla. Die. Good Camilla. Die. Now we go to the pit of fiery hell. Now that it'd be unfiery hell, but you know, you know what I mean. It's fiery hell. You're gonna want to kill me immediately. For the sake of making your life way easier. If you don't kill them, it's almost impossible. You have too many fire left. Plus the fact that she sometimes stops in the middle, that makes it really difficult. This should be it right here. I definitely remember this mission being a lot more challenging the last time I played it. Maybe I just got a lot better. Who knows? And as the orb breaks, the power star is gotten. And there it is. Episode 38 is closed. The conclusion of the worst galaxy in the game. Catch you guys back here the next time.